Hey everyone, talking about Lair des Alpes Suisse by Tower. The notes in this are ambergris, tonka, fir balsam, birch, dried needles, lily, orchid, wild thyme, basil, rosewood, nutmeg, mountain lavender, and lemon balm. This is going for kind of like uh, Switzerland mountaintop air, fresh vibe, and yeah, I think it definitely delivers on aspects of that. There's fresh air and fresh herbs in the opening with kind of a powder, floral, and then woods accords following. And there's a fresh air vibe that actually sticks with it even, you know, way, way, way many hours later. So it's not like that fresh air stuff is just there at the beginning. There's something about it at times that feels a little bit like masculine designer cologne-ish for some reason to me. But like someone wearing a masculine designer cologne while being on like a cool mountaintop as they trek their way down until they reach the ground, sort of like passing all these things along the way. But yeah, I don't know what it is that's that it's not like overall, it just smells like, you know, designer quality. Like it definitely smells niche quality for the most part, but there's just some aspect of the scent that to me, yeah, it just smells kind of like a somewhat more typical masculine cologne, but just with like a fresh air and herbal type of amped up side. Yeah, I think this would smell really classy on the right person though. Uh, I was going to say like, okay, I know I'm going to get roasted for this, but it smells kind of like Lamal to me at times. But then I looked at the Fragranica and on the this reminds me of like a lot of other people said the same thing, talking about Jean-Paul Gaultier Lamal, the one with the like body of the torso. Yeah, it actually does smell like a more niche version of that at times to me. Uh, moderate to good longevity and projection, $150 for a 50 mil, and I will link in the description where you can get a bottle or sample.